was trying to make the pack touch down. My niggas driving, that's some shit I don't do. These niggas kept and keep it G was one. What is up, everybody? It's your girl B Octavia, and welcome to Reaction Saturday. If you don't know who I am and it's your first time clicking on my video, hello, my name is B Octavia. I'm 22 years old and I'm from Washington, D.C. Now, in Reaction Saturday or Saturday Reaction, whatever you want to call it, I will be reacting to this dude. Well, it's it's an episode of Love After Lockup. And apparently this dude, he got two girls. He in jail. He got this other girl thinking she about to get married. He got the baby mom thinking she about to get married. So we're going to see on this episode. I didn't start at the first episode because I just been watching. I ain't really think about doing a reaction to it. But I'm finna do it. I want to see... <laughs> how he is finessing this you know what i'm saying because i do know that you gotta pay out of pocket if you want to talk to somebody you know that's in jail so she says she spent like hella money she spent a lot of money talking to this you know so we finna see and megan who is 28 and we got what's his name michael who is 26 let's see how he how how he's selling both of them dreams okay i'm just ready okay this is the baby mama I just want to be there sarah and i just want to start this new journey with my husband and our daughter and if i know michael i know he's not gonna be unfaithful again so how both of them gonna show up there to get him out i'm not worried when he come out that don't make sense the closer we get to the airport the more i'm starting to feel like I don't, I don't really approve of this dude, bro. Like, you shouldn't. Okay, but you never met him, so... I know, but it's just like, for one, you're a beautiful young lady. And you have plenty of options. I think you should weigh out all your options. I already have, like, this is the man I'm marrying. Like, I don't want to meet this is She's the man 28. Yes. That's new information to me. Um, That's new information to me. He's 80. Now you know. Megan's my oldest sister. I support her because I want her to you be gonna let your brother like, tell you. I turn out to be the guy she thinks he is. I always thought she'd be mad at somebody different. Like, this is... The, like who? I don't know. Is this anybody but a person in prison? Well, but, you know, he's not gonna be in prison for much longer, so... Okay. Well, I'm like, just... I like we got married in prison. She coming too. How is this going to work? It's about an eight hour drive from my place in New York to the prison in Michigan. I've done this trip several times and I don't ever want to have to do it again. Hey babe. What's up? On my way to come get you. Okay, wait. <laughs> What's this oh. going to be? He's going to New York for parole for 12 months, and he has family out there, and his daughter lives there. He has a daughter? I have brought up that he has a daughter several times, so I'm over that. Where's the baby mama at? She is... What's going on with her? They are co-parenting. They're co -parenting. She lives in New York. Mike and I did speak about him being so close to the mother of his child when he goes to New York. And there's no secrets between us. Like, he's assured me that if something was going on between his baby mom and him, he would let me know. No, he will not. How? Who he gonna ride with? Yeah. Hello? Hey, babe. When he called the baby mama boo, and he called this one boo boo. Boo boo the fool. Stop what you doing. Michael is the love of my life. And I'm ready to lose my virginity. I'm ready to have sex. Like I'm just She a virgin? She a virgin? She a virgin? Yeah. Why is he doing this to this lady? She is waiting for the right person. Talking about lose your virginity? No, I hope she don't do it. 
in Michigan to pick up Michael, and I'm just really excited. I can't wait to finally have him back in my arms. How my baby taking? She was good. Yeah. I honestly, despite everything, like could not have picked a better okay. father for Aviana. But we waited three years for this day, and it's a lot of pressure, a lot of emotions. So you for to find why, out you know, something. I just worry about how he's gonna handle it all. Don't worry about what happens on the first day. Focus on what's going to happen in a couple of days. Focus on what's going to happen next month. And that one day we're going to all wake up and we're going to be a family. I'm excited to see what it's like to have mommy and daddy around all the time and just to have our own home together and just do things as a family. And like, I, I just, I can't wait for that. She seemed like a nice girl, but both of them do. This is like. I'm ready to lose my virginity. I'm ready to have sex. Like, I'm just ready to get on the plane. I can't wait. Please call her before she get on this plane. Any my, like, info. Please don't check it in. No, I don't really approve of him, but I'm going to let her do what she got to do. We at the airport. <laughs> She's on the way, man. Please call. Don't say that. Yep, he calling. you to come like I just I don't want you to come that's messed up y'all
over bitches, I can never bitches see you through.